Oh my god. Are you telling me that I have to go all that way? This game, man. Like, I love how like there was a dark gem and everything, and it just didn't count towards your progress. Hey everybody, Nostalgia Scott coming to you guys with part 17 of Spyro, A Hero's Tale. So, there's a door right here which has another supercharged spot behind it. So we need to go back here, smash that one open, and it'll give us enough distance to get to that other door. So technically, we did have to go to the Citadel first before we could technically finish Frostbite Village. So, I've been kind of doing things in the proper order, surprisingly enough for someone who forgot how to play this game. And there's also a light gem in here too, by the way. Wait, I thought there was supposed to be a light gem in here. Oh wait, no, the light gem was in this pathway, never mind. That's what the thing was saying. Like, ooh, yeah, because in this game, boy oh boy, do things wind down fast. Oh, okay. Almost got hit by that. Luckily though, we get another teleporter once we're through. Oh yeah, good, we're on the flame breath. I hate how long the moles take to die in this game, though. Wait, what was that? Well, that was weird. I think it was just the enemy kind of despawning or something, because that was... Those don't even hurt you. It just completely stopped that, though. Wait. Eskimo Village. Okay, is this the final teleporter in this game? It is. But this is also... Oh, there's still three, so this is... The third one, we still need... Oh yeah, we have the wall jump ability now! Anyways, let's clear this and see what this does for us. It opens up a cannon, obviously. Well, it's raising it up. So I guess we'll go over here. I remember this part of the game. I don't remember, like, the speedways or anything, that's for sure. Because as a kid, I was mainly trying to get the eggs to, like, unlock the other characters, which, really, I think you can technically play them on a different account, I think. I'm not actually sure. Oh, there's 95. Never mind, there's 100. So we can't get in here. We don't have enough, technically, to get into the one in the next zone, either. Oh, that is a weird giant snow... Wait, also, why is this called Eskimo Village? With, like, a surprising lack of Eskimos. Alright, so that opened up a pathway over there. I'm trying to think of, like, what else we could do to get items here. Because we've pretty much done, like, every mini game, Except for Blink. So, don't, 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 don't quote me on that, because we still have to do that. Also, how do I get that? Nothing here goes up that high. Alright, so that's all we can do for right now. Goodbye, Mr. Eskimo. Man, game, can you, like... Thank you. Oh, there's an Eskimo down there, but... Killing them doesn't really do anything for us. They're just kind of there. Come on! I clicked the Flame Breath, and it just, like, 360'd instead. Huh. So this is the dead end pathway, so I'm assuming... Oh, watch out for the icicles up above. I'm assuming those will damage... Yeah, I was about to say, this is probably another dark gem. Oh, this is water, not... Is this this... Oh, never mind. They sink. My bad. Aw, oh, man! That's one thing I hate about uh, this game, is where the checkpoints sometimes are. Like the last zone, there was very few ways to actually die. I think those icicles falling from the ceiling are supposed to be like a precursor to like what's happening over here itself, so that's a thing. Oh, I thought we were going to take damage from him, and I'm just going to be salty. Thank you for not hitting me, Eskimo, because I don't really feel like dying. Not today. Hopefully this is something useful, though. Alright, it's another egg. So we're at 50 eggs. I think there's 80 eggs and 100 light gems. But we have four more eggs. 
six more light gems and two more uh, dark gems. And we do know for a fact where one of the uh, dark gems are. They're right there. Now we gotta see like which platform we can go to here. Uh, are they not gonna fall again? Hello? Oh god, they take forever to fall down again. Alright, we made it. So now we can open up this pathway, and we only need one more dark gem. Oh, that was actually really cool. Not gonna lie. And this is for some kind of collectible, it looks like, and that's it. Oh. Oh, look! We haven't had this since the uh, Water World, which I guess was technically the last level, but we've only seen them in two zones. Also, what the heck is going on down there? Oh! Sneaky. This is definitely a gem or an egg. Are you kidding me? I wasted one of my last two keys on that? This game sometimes, man. Oh, there's a light gem up there, and we got some pole vaulting. Not looking forward to this, but... Oh my god! Are you serious? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my god. Are you telling me that I have to go all that way? This game, man. Like, I love how like there was a dark gem and everything, and it just didn't count towards your progress. Of like distance. Wait. Why would those drop so prematurely over there? That was just weird, but okay. Alright, let's try this again. Can you, like, actually let me charge? I hate the camera. Okay, this enemy, though, I can technically deal with. Alright, thank you. And that's all we need for the light gem. Alright, excellent. Really weird section of the level, considering that there's no save points or anything around here. And that, yeah. Luckily, we don't need any of these to get back. Just land right here. I guess we technically could have died if we wanted to go through it faster. But I don't feel like dying. Not, not this time. Now we need to figure out how to get up there exactly, because... There's stuff up there that we need to do. And, like, I mean, there's a lot up there that we need to do. So there's... Oh, wait a minute! Never mind, we actually can't get up there. This is the light gym path. I'm an idiot. Alright, so we want to take one. this, and we want to go down to... The icy camp, because there's two pathways we can go over this way. So we'll go this way. Like I said, we also need to do Blink's level still. Which will be another two total items. Okay, so we can go back that way. Oh yeah, never mind. We couldn't technically finish a lot of this anyway because we didn't have the right power up. We were supposed to go to the icy citadel to find the elder. And then apparently there weren't a lot of reasons to be using this power up until now. I really hate that about games. Are you serious? Like, what is he doing? Spyro, you, you really you really baffle me sometimes, man. There we go. Also, that's a little concerning. Oh my god, don't tell me the cannon was on the other side. Oh wait, the cannon's right there. We have to raise up the cannon. I'm just gonna like kind of like cheese some of this. Thank you very much. Ah, I'm cheesing the game. One random and oh, this is probably the switch, right? This has got to be the switch. Boom. 
Don't know why it went down so far. Wait, can I? I kind of want to go there first. Yeah, because there's something clearly over there. So let's go in here first. Oh, it's an egg. Just, just a random egg and nothing else. No threats, no hazards, no anything like that. Just an egg. Hmm. We actually might have time to do blink in here. And maybe red if we have time. I don't think we will, but it's worth a shot. Also, I hate to get to the cannon. You need to go... Well, I guess technically you could have went the other way. Oh, let me up. Thank you. I didn't want to die. Alright, we need to... Not that high. Actually, no, that was the perfect height. Never mind. Oh, you can't cheese it like that. Oh, well. Wait, I didn't keep clicking X. Why did you keep jumping? I'm not complaining, but... Interesting. Oh, uh, what do we got here? We got only a small zone. And the dark gem, which is just chilling over here by itself. And that's the final dark gem. Boom, now we can take on red. Also, man, who am I supposed to use for my thumbnail if we haven't found anybody to talk to yet? Oh, it's like a... Wait, why did my jump just get stunted so hard? This looks like it's going to be one of those annoying levels where we kind of just got to wait. I'm going to have a drink while we wait for this. Rockstar Pure Zero, by the way, is great. The uh, mango strawberry. Alright, can we make the next one? Yes, we can. And I think I botched it. Yeah, now we gotta wait. Though that is a light gem, so... For light gem, that'll be number five, so we're missing four. One of these eggs and one of these gems are gonna be blank. So that'll bring us to six light gems and five eggs. This is boring. There's just a random Eskimol up there that hasn't even been doing anything. I think, yeah, we still need to go that way though too, right? Yeah, it looks like it's towards the little empty zone. There's some dark gem shards down there that we could get. But I don't think there's anything over there of particular value. Is there? Wait, no, that's the secret little alcove. It's not even secret. It's just... Oh, it's just gems. Okay. I guess that would make sense. It is really funny, though, how they'll sometimes have, like, breakable, like, rocks or ground pieces or things like that, and other times they won't. So, I guess we'll continue on. Ugh. Oh, and we actually need to get up on the platforms to get up there. I think that's the way out, right? No, that's the way out. So then... What the heck is this way? Or the other way? Uh, an egg, I'm gonna assume? Could be another light gem, but I highly doubt they give us that many light gems in a row. Seems kind of, um, counterintuitive. Also, I don't know if the secondary platform, or the... Tertiary, tertiary, whatever the, the the primary platform. Tertiary is the third one. Would be enough to get up there. So we're gonna take this one. I don't know what like these Eskimos are doing. They really don't seem to be much of a threat. That's for sure. Hmm. So I don't think we've been that way, have we? Also, we didn't somehow... Oh, it's literally just gems. I don't even know why I bothered with that. Like, we really don't need gems. We have 26,000. We're not going to drop below 20,000 here anytime soon. So, we gotta go back this way. This is worth the final dark gem, though. So, it was definitely not a waste, and it was worth a light gem. Which, we need to get to 80 to get the one in Dragonfly Falls, which I still think is ridiculous, by the way. 
Okay, so we need to go that way, right? Yes, we need to go down this way. Oh my- oh, it's when you hold down circle by accident. Yeah, we need to go this way. Bruh. There's no dark gem this way, and we know Blink isn't this way, so what the heck is this way? Wait, are you? You're kidding me, right? Oh! This is to go back to Hunter! Okay, okay, I don't mind that. Because I know I'll have to go back to him and get 100%. That'll probably just do off screen, because you guys know where everything is. I already showed you. So nothing cool there. Wait, that was actually part of. Uh. That was actually part of Gloomy Glacier. Is that just where we have to go? Oh, wait, no, we're done in here. We can leave the Eskimo village. Go ahead, Spyro. If you've got money to spend, I am here to I really don't care, money bags. How many times? Wait, what happened here? I don't remember this. I remember there being a cliff there to deal with. We come from a different. Wait, I still don't get how he hit me. I swear it's only when I use flame breath that I get hit in the dumbest of ways. Oh, this platform. Yeah, I know what we have to do. We have to wait for this one to go down. And easy peasy. I think you're supposed. They want you to take the third, the second platform there, but it's really not necessary. Yeah, this should be the final area, right? Other than up there that we can't get to. Oh, never mind, it does hurt you. That one time I got hit by it just straight up didn't hurt me. What do we got here going on? Like I said, there's no dark gems whatsoever left, so... That's a thing. Oh. Why did you jump backwards? Does that even make sense, Spyro? I, I really just straight up don't think that made any sense. Wait a second. Another egg thief? That, that is interesting. So let's see. Blink will be the fifth egg. One of the eggs will definitely be in there. Same with the light gem. So I think technically, other than a few light gems, we're essentially done. Now I remember the final boss being difficult, I don't know if that was just me as a kid, and I don't remember exactly how any of these boss fights in this game play out other than Nasty Nark, because that was the one that I remember. Um, yeah. Oh, I see, this is gonna be like a, a dodge the mole platformer section. Bye bye mole. I think we can go this way, right? Yeah, we can go this way. Swing your axe. Kill man with axe. Good. Wait for this to end because I don't want to take any unnecessary damage. And then we'll go find Blink. I Was Blink in the, the penguin section of the level? I don't remember. And I took unnecessary damage because I'm an idiot again. Also, I love how like you don't need any of the breaths in any of these given sections. So... If there's a light gem and a dragon egg in that thing, then yeah, we have everything outside of, um, uh, Blink. So we're good. We're good, we're good, we're good. The only one I'm not sure about is the last of the collectibles in the Icy Citadel. There's the, what, one gem or the one egg or the one whatever. One item. And then this one has Blink, and then behind the door. And then the one that we have to go back and backtrack in the other zone. So... Other than... Oh my god, I'm getting stuck on it, because it has a weird hitbox. Is it this way that I need to go to backtrack? It is. Okay. Oh god, I brought up the stupid help menu. I think we have time to go and do one of the, um... Wait, I thought I got smushed, but that wasn't me getting... Stupid game. Alright, we're back in the village, which means we can get some health. And now we gotta go find Doofus there. I know he's not behind any of the breakable stuff. Because we had found him first. I, 
think we have time to go and do the do one spark or one blink level. I think blink was this way, right? Yeah, see sometimes like they just fly up and die, and other times they don't, so. Actually was was blink this way? I don't think Blink was this way, was he? Uh-huh. No, this is just her, so this is the cannon section. And I don't think that platform raising up meant... It just meant that light gem of this. And no, this wasn't Blink. So what the heck was Blink? I guess we could use some more health, though, so we'll grab some more health before we do anything. We could also technically open this up now, so we'll open this up. Yeah, I love how, like, the sun didn't really do anything. Do I need keys? I don't think I need any keys. They're really not big on chests anymore. I think there's a lot more chests in the next world. I think. I kind of vaguely remember that, but... Also, was this the snowball? I I think Blink was this way though, wasn't he? Yeah, I'm pretty sure Blink was around the underside of this level somewhere. Like down on the ground level. I think. I don't actually even know. Blink, where are you? If you're here, Blink. Mm, that was a bad joke. Oh, there he is! Alright. Meet again, Spyro. I'm looking forward to exploring in this area. I'm always up for a challenge. Underground, in tight spaces, and freezing cold. I love it. Should I explore below ground? Why do you like the freezing cold? I don't like the... Well, I like the cold. I don't know about the freezing cold. <laughs> All right, five shards. So we need to come up with a witty nickname for this: Blink on Ice. Actually, that's actually perfect. Keep that in the memo. Blink on Ice. Oop. I don't even know why I'm bothering with the gems. Wait, I see that dig dig hole up there. Is there a map? Oh, these places don't have maps. Oh, that's that's fun. Whoa. That is... Wait, can I... Ah... How come I'm just starting to notice these? Also, I don't really... care for sections like this very much. Ooh, he, cause he can like barely jump, like let's be real here. Oh wait a minute, are these the ones that I can throw bombs to? Nope, never mind. What's the point of these, then? Wait, can I shoot them? Huh, what's the point of being Oh, I don't think I'm supposed to even be down here, am I? Not yet. I feel like I'm supposed to be above, and those are just, like, safety nets. Okay, that's the spot where we slid down. Oh, there's the wall jump here. Alright. We haven't found a single shard yet. Um, let me guess. Ow. You mean plant? Oof. I thought that was just a random light gem. Wait, what the heck is that? Random bug? I kind of want to see what the heck is over here exactly. No, we died. I pulled an idiot. Whee! I feel like you almost moved too fast to even take damage there, but whatever. Now, does the thing stay broken after we've break broken it, even though... Okay, it does. I hate that part. 
I hate platforming like that. Also, why did my TV turn on? I think it's turning off, but it just looks like it's turning on. Yeah, I'm already not a fan of this level. I'm not a big fan of the Blink ones. Like, I like Blink as a character, but I really wish his, like, zones were a little better. It doesn't really work with the camera very well, and that's a big issue I have with this. Can you... Stay... The... The fact that the camera is getting me stun-locked into all these enemies is... And double jumps just didn't work again. I want to do this in this episode before we move on, because we only have one more, like, home world to go to in the next, le uh, in the game, so then... That'll probably be two or three episodes there at least, and then we'll technically beat the game just have the after-game stuff. I'm gonna kill you, because I don't like you in my way. There we go. Are you serious? Because he has that stunted jump thing going on that just screwed me over again. Man, we really need to find a dark gem shard. That way we can, like, at least get a save point. I'll go back to the first Blink level any day of the week now. While wow, this one looks way cooler, no pun intended, it, it's just so much worse. Man, by the time I killed that one, the other one started coming back, which was not good. Alright. This time, ignore that stupid platform that I went on last time, and go this way. There we go. Oh god, the bug guy. Uh oh. Wait, are you serious? This level is unforgiving. Holy cow. I actually might have to end the episode here, because, uh, this is gonna be difficult. Like, I technically don't need 100%. I just feel like when you're doing a Let's Play for people, they want to see you get 100%, you know? Oh, thank god. Like, also, the fact that they give you the bomb thing here... Isn't there another mole over there, though? Oh, those are what are shooting poison at me. It's the bugs. God, they're so weird and derpy. Now, can I kill these other spider things on here? Okay, so the spider enemy is technically invincible. That's nice to know. But, well, why do I care about gems? Why am I stuck? Barrel. Oh yeah, it looks like there's a safe zone over here. So we'll get down here for right now. Oh, thank god. Woo! So drop this, and boom. Alright, so in the next episode, we'll continue on with these blink levels and then take on red. So if you guys enjoyed this video, please remember to like, comment, subscribe, join the Discord, join the Patreon, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.